Hello everyone and welcome to the Alliance Francaise Auditorium. Today is a very special day. Today, our sister Sandhya presents her Bharatanatyam Arangetram. This is the culmination of 10 years of dedication, determination and hard work. And she is delighted to present this to everyone here today. Along with the people in the, in the auditorium, we are so grateful to have you here with us on this live stream. In, over there is the auditorium and we'll be going over there now. This is a beautiful auditorium filled with lots of space and capacity for all our guests. And for the people at home, we, we, we are so thankful that you are here with us today. Here, we have a guest table with a beautiful floral arrangement and a guest book for people to write their well wishes to Sandhya. And over here, we have a beautiful kolam made with flower petals, here to welcome our guests to our auditorium and today's performance. Thank you for being a part of tonight's performance. Sit back, Relax and enjoy. Hariyum and good evening to one and all. Welcome to Pitanjali, Bharatanatyam Arangetram of our sister Sandhya Danabalan. My name is Sangeeta, and together with my elder sister Sharanya, we are your MCs for tonight. Tonight is a tribute and offering by Sandhya for our beloved father. We are delighted to have with us Sandhya's first Bharatanatyam teacher, Ms. Sri Devi Sivaraja Singham. Before we begin tonight's offering, we kindly request that you turn off your mobile phones or switch them to silent mode. Please also refrain from unauthorized flash photography and videography. We will begin the evening with bhajans and a short message from our guru and the founder of the Temple of Fine Arts, His Holiness Swami Shantanand Saraswati. We humbly request that you remain silent during this time. <laughs> Yengal parandamal mai yadagai padungale Pallir balar choriyum mehangale Yengal parandamal mai yadagai padungale Ten kodi tendal tarum ragangale Yengal shi krishna murti Puhar Padungale Ten Kodi Tendal Tarum Ragangale Yangal Shi Krishna Murti Puhar Padungale Yangal Shi Krishna Murti Puhar Padungale Pullangudal Kodutta Mungil Hale Yengal Purushotamal Pugar Padungale Vandadum Malar Gangai Totangale Yengal Madhusudanal Pugar Padungale Ten Pulla Kudal Kodutungil Hale Guru Vayur Tallil Avantavar Hilgavan 
ஒரு கொடியோடு மதுராவை ஆழ்கின்றவன் கண்ணில் அவள் தவழ்கின்றவன் ஒரு கொடியோடு மதுராவை ஆழ்கின்றவன் திருவேங்கடத்தில் அவன் அருள்கின்றவன் எங்கள் ஸ்ரீரங்கத்தில் பள்ளி கொள்கின்றவன் திருவேங்கடத்தில் அவன் அருள்கின்றவன் எங்கள் ஸ்ரீரங்கத்தில் பள்ளி கொள்கின்றவன் எங்கள் ஸ்ரீரங்கத்தில் பள்ளி கொள்கின்றவன் லாங்கோழல் தோட்டங்களே எங்கள் மதுசூதனல் புகழ் பாடுங்களே சொல்லா தொழல் கொடுத்த மூங்கில்களே பாஞ்சாலி துயர் காக்க தன் கை கொடுத்தால் அந்த பாரத போர் முடிக்க சங்கை எடுத்தான் பாஞ்சாலி புகழ் காக்க தன் கை கொடுத்தான் அந்த பாரத போர் முடிக்க சங்கை எடுத்தான் பாண்டவர்க்கு உரிய அவர் தம் பங்கை கொடுத்தான் நாம் படிப்பதற்கு கீதை என்னும் பாடம் கொடுத்தா பாண்டவர்க்கு உரிய அவர் தம் பங்கை கொடுத்தார் நாம் படிப்பதற்கு கீதை என்னும் பாடம் கொடுத்தார் நாம் படிப்பதற்கு கீதை என்னும் பாடம் கொடுத்தார் கொடுத்த மூங்கில்களே எங்கள் புருஷோத்தமன் புகழ் பாடுங்களே வண்டாடும் மலர் கங்கை தோட்டங்களே எங்கள் மதுசூதனம் புகழ் பாடுங்களே புல்லாங்குழல் கொடுத்த மூங்கில்களே humble salutations dear friends hearty greetings and all the good wishes to all of you humble salutations to the divine dancers parameshwara and parameshwari every moment and every movement from the tiny little atomic particle and sub particles to the stars nebula and the galaxies or but the visible nirtya nataka the dance drama of this divine pair parameshwara and parvati this great cosmic drama with all its perfect music and rhythm motions and emotions was revealed to the great sage bharata muni centuries ago and through him the great book natya shastra a treatise that deals with all aspects of dance music and drama came into existence like a banyan tree it spread all over the subcontinent and became the various schools of classical dancing bharatanatyam is a southern school of this great tradition hundreds and hundreds of men and women have perfected this art form and delighted art lovers all over the world may the divine dancers shiva kamishwari shiva kamishwara vibrate in and through and bless her arangetram with success is our humble prayers may the almighty bless her one day she becomes a great artist performing artist bringing joy and happiness and pride to the family pride to the institution and joy and peace to the whole world of art lovers is also our humble prayers we are going to begin now 
relax yourself and enjoy thank you very much invoking the divine presence that surrounds us tonight we begin with an offering to the gurus of sandhya sandhya will be starting the night with a dynamic pushpanjali followed by two verses from the guru ashtakam by adi shankaracharya both set to ragam hamsa dwani in ekatalam and kandanade in a world of material riches physical health and even a great spouse the mind is only nourished when it is grounded to its guru and to growth sandhya expresses her gratitude to her gurus for nourishing and molding her to make tonight possible after a vibrant rendition of the pushpanjali and guru ashtakam sandhya will perform the alaripu in misra chapu talam swift steady and precise in movement the rigidity of form and grace coexist here symbolizing the blossoming of a dancer with every step on stage sandhya offers her dance to the supreme lord and the quiet presence of our father embracing all the blessings present tonight ಸುಮಧುರಂ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಭಕ್ತ ಕಾಮವರ್ಷದ್ಯುತರುಕಿಸಲಯ ಜನ ಜನ ಕಿಟ್ಟ 
Sandhya says, Dance has been a friend of mine since the tender age of five. My mother sparked the love for me, enrolling both my older sister and I in Bharatanatyam classes with teacher Shri. With the following four years dedicated to learning the fundamentals of Bharatanatyam and offering the art at temple performances. I was soon allowed to develop this relationship with Bharatanatyam at Temple of Fine Arts under teacher Lakshmi Krishnan in 2012. In my first year at TFA, I had the opportunity to participate in Ramayana, a dance drama production. Amidst the grandeur of the stage, passionate dancers and larger than life sets, a spark lit in me to continue in this art form, pushing myself to be the best. This desire blessed me to be part of two more of TFA's productions, Dharma Ashoka in 2015 and The Rajput Princess in 2016. The love continued to grow, providing me new insights into the art form. My dance journey hasn't been one without its trials and tribulations. I experienced my lowest point in dance when I didn't clear my stage five dance exam in 2020. After much training, it came as a disappointment and felt like a personal setback. When the world felt like it was caving in, something special happened. All my life, Amma, had always been the parent taking on the role to be present in all my dance activities, with Appa content in playing the role of transporter and audience at our performances. At my lowest, it was Appa who stepped in and became my beacon of light. Unwavering in his support, he gave me the confidence to try again he became my dance appa and my biggest supporter, working patiently behind the scenes with teacher Lakshmi to get my focus back on track. With his support and belief, I was able to clear my stage five exam and have not looked back since. Although appa isn't here physically today, I know he is watching over me with love and pride. Thank you for believing in me, Appa, then and now. I look back at our memories fondly tonight as I embark on this journey, and I can only remember your ever calming presence. You are my anchor, the ground beneath my feet. As I grace this stage today with your blessings, I take a sliver of your strength with me, Appa. Kumari Lakshmi Krishnan, the Bardhan Natyam Guru of our debutant, graduated from the Temple of Fine Arts in Bardhan Natyam and Natuvangam under the able guidance of Sri Madhi Kamakshi Jayaraman. She received the Maha Guru Swami Shivananda Award in 1993 for her dedication to the arts. Kumari Lakshmi is a business graduate from the National University of Singapore and has been a full-time teacher at the Temple of Fine Arts since 2003. She has performed widely in most of TFA stage productions in Singapore, Malaysia, Australia and India. She has trained and groomed several students towards their Arangetram and continues to train and guide them after graduation too. She is currently involved in choreography and training of dancers in most of TFA stage productions and shows. In March 2021, she released her dance film, Transcend Dance, a Bharatanatyam group choreography work, tracing the journey of five dancers. 
In September 2022, she was awarded the Natya Acharya Mani Award by Apsaras Arts. A firm believer that we are always students, Lakshmi continues to seek opportunities to learn and grow. Sandhya will now present the Jadi Swaram, a dynamic lineup of Swaras and Jadis strung together to present the sharpness of movement and music. The Jadi Swaram is unique in its swiftness, showcasing the grace the physical form can exude. Sharpness, precision, and charm are the characteristics of a Jadi Swaram with the dynamics of each movement increasing as the piece progresses. The beauty of the Jadi Swaram is seen when the dancer handles all of its grandeur with grace. Sandhya will now present the Jadi Swaram in Ragam Hamsanandi and Adi Talam. Sani the Magariga
It gives us great pleasure to introduce the members of the orchestra for tonight. On the Natavangam, we have Kumari Lakshmi Krishnan. <clears throat> Kumari Lakshmi trained in Natavangam in Coimbatore under Sri Madhi Kamakshi Jayaraman for five years. She presented her Natavangam Arangetram in 2003 making her the first student of TFA International to have graduated in Natavangam. Kumari Lakshmi also received advanced training in Natavangam from the late Sri Bhagavatula Sita Rama Sharma of Chennai in 2009. She has accompanied many TFA students internationally for their Arangetrams. Lakshmi has had the blessed opportunity to accompany renowned dancers such as Sri Shankar Kandasamy of Malaysia, Sri Mavin Koo of London, and Amrita Lahiri of India. Over the years, she has also been blessed to work with and learn from TFA directors Kumari Suryakala, Sri Madhi Kamakshi Jayaraman, Sri Shankar Kandasamy, as well as Sri Mavin Koo. She continues to find new avenues to explore the art of Nadvangam. On vocals, we have Sri Kartik Ravindran. <clears throat> Kartik was introduced to the musical form by his parents at the age of three. He was formally initiated into Carnatic vocal music by teachers Govinda Rajan and Sabari Girish. He furthered his training under senior musicians Rudra Patnam Ramakant and Sangeeta Kalanidhi R.K. Srikantran. His sensitivity as a complete artist was later honed by Dr. Raj Kumar Bharati from whom he continues to seek inspiration and guidance. Kartik has worked on various nuances of vocal music in multiple genres, both as a solo performer, as well as rendering vocal support to his teachers in various concerts at home and abroad. Apart from being a vocalist, he has worked with various artists in scoring and producing music. He has assisted his mentors for live and recorded productions in Singapore and India. Together as a vocal performer and music producer, Kartik continues to push artistic boundaries in vocal expressions and musical aesthetics. Kartik is a part-time vocal teacher at the Temple of Fine Arts. On the Mridangam, we have Sri Trivandram D. Rajagopal. Rajasar, as we lovingly call him, hails from a family of musicians. He is the grandson of the renowned Veena exponent, Mridangist and vocalist, Sri Bhagavadishwara Iyer, and the son of the late Sri B. Doreswami. Mridangam staff artist of All India Radio, Trivandrum. Rajasar took up Mridangam from his father at the tender age of seven and went on to complete his post-diploma in music, Mridangam. Rajasar received a central government cultural scholarship for advanced training with Mridangam Vidwan, Laya Chudamani, late Sri R. Vaidyanadan 
and A top star artist of All India Radio, Chennai. In 1989, he was given the award for the best mridangist from Sri Swadi Tirunal Sangeeta Sabha. Last year, Rajasar received the award for best senior concert performance at the prestigious Music Academy in Chennai, as well as the Sangeeta Kala Nipuna from Rityalaya Aesthetic Society. Rajasar is recognized as an A-graded artist of Mridangam at the All India Radio and has accompanied many leading artists. He has also received training for dance accompaniment from the great Natuvangam exponent Adayar K. Lakshmanan Sir and Padma Bhushan Kale Mamani Sri Dhananjayan Sir. Raju Sir has over 33 years of experience as a Mridangam teacher and has been teaching at TFA Singapore since 2007. Under his tutelage and guidance, many students have trained to the Arangetram level and have won National Arts Council competitions as well. Apart from teaching, Raju Sir has also contributed much to the Singapore music culture by regularly collaborating with a myriad of local and international artists to present public performances. We are indeed privileged to have him as our Bridangam teacher at TFA Singapore. On the violin, we have Sri Narayanan Namashivayam. Narayanan Namashivayam, also known as Nara in the music community, is a Singaporean musician who enjoys fiddling with the fiddle since young. A school teacher by profession, Nara contributes actively to the Singapore art scene. His music reflects strong Indian ethnicity with a contemporary touch. This is mainly due to his core training in South Indian classical music and keen interest in melodic tunes of various genres. Nara has collaborated with popular bands such as Sa Trio, Orchestra Trio and Brahmastra, infusing his unique musical perspective to other genres. He was part of many music events such as Kala Utsav, National Arts Council, Arts in Your Neighbourhood and a variety of dance dramas. As a music enthusiast, Nara instills a love for music in others by imparting knowledge to music lovers through fun and engaging learning activities and games. In his free time, he experiments in composing tunes. He co-wrote and published the song Kangalal with his musician friends. Nara is a part-time violin teacher at the Temple of Fine Arts. On the flute, we have Sri Raghavendran Rajasegaran, fondly known as Raga. Raga began playing the Carnatic flute at the tender age of 11, after he was deeply inspired by renowned flautist, as well as his teacher, Dr. Ganavinodhan Ratnam. Raga pursued his musical dream at La Salle College of the Arts, Singapore and graduated with a bachelor degree with honors in music, jazz performance in 2015. He trained under acclaimed jazz virtuosos, Dr. Tim O'Dwyer, head of music program, La Salle College of the Arts, and jazz composer, Greg Leons. He has also undergone musical training from Grammy-nominated Indian flute virtuosos, Pandit Ronu Majumdar, and Sri Ravichandra Kulur. Raga is the co-founder of Music Love Yoga, an initiative that aims to empower lives through yoga with music all over the world. 
He has recorded for countless albums and musical productions and has performed at many music and dance festivals locally and abroad. Esplanade Singapore also awarded Raga with opportunities to perform at various jazz festivals in Singapore with his band Raga Jazz. We are happy to have him as our flute teacher at TFA Singapore. Also on the Nattu Vangam tonight is Kumari Swadi Satish. Swadi is a graduate in Bharatanatyam from the Temple of Fine Arts. She first started learning at the age of six from Kumari Vijaya Lakshmi Vela Yudham. She then continued under the tutelage of Kumari Sujata Raja Gopalan and presented her Arangetram in 2012. She began her teaching journey thereafter and is now part of the Faculty of Dance at the Temple of Fine Arts, Singapore. Swadi recently presented a kacheri as part of her Stage 4 Karnatic Vocal Exam under the guidance of Sri Madhi Rajalakshmi Sekar. For someone who has been deeply involved in the world of music and dance for several years, learning the Nattu Vangam was a natural progression. And so, she began her journey under Kumari Lakshmi Krishnan. Swati is currently pursuing a master's degree in education in the field of dance teaching at the Royal Academy of Dance, London. Today will be her first stage presentation on the Nattu Vangam. The incoming item is the Varnam. Sandhya rejoices in presenting Nadane Aretava Sakie, a Varnam composed by Sri Tiruviri Malay Nataraja Sundaram Pillai. The ever charming, intelligent Muruga is one of Sandhya's favourites, as she grew up listening to stories of him, enamoured by each one of them. The adoration for Muruga spills over in her portrayal of the love-struck Nayika in this Varnam. The Nayika seeks for Lord Muruga, urging her Saki to bring him to her. Joy fills her soul as she evokes his presence in her mind, anticipating his arrival each time. However, she grows in disappointment when he fails to come to her. In that moment, she realizes her love transcends physicality. In seeking the joy the Lord invokes in her, she realizes that he will always be with and within her and that she is blessed with eternal love and wisdom through music and dance. Friends, the Varnam, Nadane Aretava Sakie, in Ragam Kamboji and Adi Talam.
Yeah. Uh-huh. 
night's repertoire with a padam anbu shivakami amma set to ragam chakravaham and talam tisra adi the, this piece is a devotee's outpouring on the divine mother she says to her 
you are the embodiment of love, grace, and compassion. You are the supreme light and the loving consort of the joyous Dille Nadaraja. Oh Mother, you are the epitome of joy, the reflection of the Lord and the manifestation of his static form. Intoxicated I am, for you reside in my heart as the supreme absoluteness. Please grant me vision of your various forms. Kamakshi, Lalita, Meenakshi, and Visalakshi. Come to me as the ever youthful Bala Tripura Sundari. O oh, Queen of Dance, bless me with the blissful sight of your tinkling bells and nectarine smile as you perform your celestial dance. I eagerly await you, O oh Mother. Come quickly and take me home to thy divine abode. It brings Sandhya joy to present this piece with her Amma in mind, as she too takes on many roles like the Divine Mother to make this life blessed for her. Dear friends, Anba Shivakami Amma, a composition of His Holiness Swami Shantanand Saraswati. In 
The masculine ego, the transcendental, the all-knowing. Sandhya presents a padam on the divine Parameshwara, singing the praises of Lord Shiva in all his grandeur. The dancer says, containing the divine knowledge as Ganga, in your braided locks, you graciously allow the wisdom to those who seek it. The sound from your Damaru removes all fear of life and death. You remove all blemishes, O holder of the trident. Sandhya holds this peace close to her heart as she finds strength 
in the intertwining of masculine and feminine energy that exudes power. She has learned to embrace the masculine within her. The Lord Shiva being a source of power and inspiration. Friends, presenting He Parameshwara, another outpouring of His Holiness, Swami Shantanand Saraswati, in Raga Mohanam and Adi Talam. Oh, 
ईश्वर है बृहदीश्वर Presenting the final piece for tonight, Sandhya dances in joy to Adigindran in Nul Adigindran, the vibrant Tillana by His Holiness Swami Shantanand Saraswati. A Tillana presents pure dance with brisk movements coordinated into graceful sequences. The constant, unlimited joy is the soul of this particular tillana. The joy of dance saturates the peace as Krishna dances along with Radha in complete surrender. All of the world joins in this celebration of dance, spreading this light of unadulterated love all over. Sandhya presents this tillana with her Appa and Amma in her heart as Krishna and Radha, the embodiments of love. Sandhya says, Appa, I know you are smiling with me tonight. Tonight is to us, to the joy we have shared that will transcend time. Tonight is to celebrate that. Thank you, Appa for showing me what love and joy should feel like. Presenting the Tillana, Adagindran in Nul Adagindran, in Ragam Dvijavanti and Aditalam. This will be followed by the Mangalam.
നദി തീരത്തിലെ മനവൃന്ദാവന പൂർണിമദിനത്തിലെ
so it is nun kalai kovil and may i wish all the children you have just passed kindergarten school go to the primary go to the secondary go to the college go to graduation go to phd delete then you can say i know something katradu kai man alavu kalladadu ulagu alavu apdinu saraswathiye solirukkan so art has no end there is no perfect artist a perfect artist is a person who is 99.5 percent perfect but point fight is yet there are flaw and he goes on and down when does he finish when he merges with god or when he dies one of the two till then it is learning and learning and the learning and the best teacher is the best student be a very good student you can be a very good teacher try to obey you can command you try to obey as a student the teacher whatever she says and one day you can be the teacher to command and if you are going to only command and not obey you will never be able to command because your words will be empty bullet these are all some of the beautiful cultural background behind this so called bharatanatya arangetram may we pray to the divine mother may we pray to the divine dancer shiva kameshwara shiva kameshwari kama kameshwara kameshwari to the divine pair may they always pulsate and throb act and activate in and through the muscles and the veins and the blood vessels and cells in the eyes and the nose and the ears and the hands and always produce beautiful graceful dance and one day make us all realize namaste stu nartaki devi nitya rupe namo namaha namaste mahime shobe susurupe namo namaha thank you very much we would like to invite sandhya back on stage we will also now like to congratulate and invite the rest of our immediate fam- immediate family to join us on stage we would also like to invite miss lalita chandrasegaran president of temple of fine arts singapore sandhya's guru kumari lakshmi krishnan as well as our senior dance teachers kumari sujata rajagopalan and shrimadi deepa sri watson on stage for the presentation of the graduation certificate Kumari Sujata Rajagopalan will now read the graduation certificate. The certificate reads as following: The Temple of Fine Arts International, whereas by the grace of Shiva Nataraja, Shiva Kama Sundari, the Cosmic Nayaka Nayika, the Divine Inseparables. the very source from whom springs all fine arts with the blessings of bharata muni the adi guru of all artists and with the blessings of sadguru his holiness swami shantanand saraswati it has been recognized that sandhya danabalan having completed and fulfilled the requirements of the stipulated course and mastering the basics of bharatanatyam with the able guidance of the gurus of this institution is here upon conferred the sacred title of nrityanjali <laughs> from
from this day, 17 December 2022, and is acknowledged as a graduate of the Temple of Fine Arts. May she, from this day of Arangetram, blossom fully, ceaselessly strive to achieve excellence, bring joy and glory to the arts, to the gurus, and to this institution. This is our fervent hope and prayer. May the divine and the masters and the gurus shower upon her their blessings. Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. This is signed by our president and the gurus of this institution. Ms. Lalita will now present a gift to Sandhya on behalf of the Temple of Fine Arts. Sandhya and our Amuma will now honour the artists in the orchestra. On the Natavangam and Guru of our graduate, Kumari Lakshmi Krishnan. On the Mridangam, Sri Trivandram D. Rajagopal. On vocals, Sri Kartik Ravindran. <laughs> On the violin, Sri Narayanan Namashivayam. On the flute, Sri Raghavendran Rajasekaran. Also, for the first time on the Natavangam, dance teacher Kumari Swadi Satish. Before we invite our Amma, Sheila, to say a few words, 
Amama, Akka and I want to give Sandhya flowers too. Shall we? <laughs> Hello, everyone. Uh, thank you so much for being with us here this evening. Um, most of you know me really well, and I'm rarely lost for words. Today, as a parent, I am lost for words. Thank you so much for being here. And Molo, you did so well. I am so, so proud of you. I came prepared with tissue paper, so please bear with me, okay? Um, two of you come over as well. <laughs> Don't want you to feel left out. <laughs> so, um, so Sandhya's, Sandhya has been such a joy to parent. And very often I describe her as our easiest child. Now before the other two get upset with me, she's always been the child who walks into a room with a smile, is always looking out, to give joy to everyone around her. And I'm just so happy. Today, she has had the opportunity to experience joy. Joy in expressing herself and doing something she loves. I am so, so proud of you, Molo. And I hope you continue dancing forever and ever because you deserve joy every single day of your life. So thank you for giving me joy today as your parents. I, I, I had to come prepared with a list of thank yous because um, I, I knew I was going to, but I forgot my glasses. What are we going to do now? And as always, I can't remember my password. Okay, <laughs> I'm good now. Um, this journey has been a, through a very tough year for us as a family, right? And it's only been possible because there's been a whole village behind us. So today I stand here with an abundance of gratitude. And the gratitude is to who I call the members of the Dhanabalan Girls Village. So let me start by thanking some people. Uh, we could be here for another two hours if I had to thank everyone else, but I have to thank the following people for making today possible, for making it possible for my dear daughter to be up here uh, expressing herself. So I start off with Swamji, my guru, uh, who's been there through thick and thin, and always held my hand really tight. I know he's always watching over us. Gobinji Indrama, for being the epitome of love and presence every single day, and we feel you here tonight. Lakshmi, I'll come to you in a while. It has to be a little long, okay? So I'll come to you in a little while. But at Temple of Fine Arts, I think every, t every guru is a child's guru. And Sandhya is here today primarily because of Sri. Thank you so much for being here tonight and starting that dance journey with Sandhya. And I will always be eternally grateful to you for that. Teacher Sri. <laughs> Deepa, Suja. All the other teachers, Varsha, Madhu, uh, Swadi, I, uh, who am I, I'm missing out, Indrani, uh, Sneha, Sne, Sneha Jiji's got special thank you later. So hang on, Sneha Jiji. 
Uh, I mean, it's such a joy to watch what I call the next generation of teachers. And my daughter has been a beneficiary of the next generation of teachers. So thank you all for doing what you do and for loving what you do, because that's why this art form continues in the way that it does today. It's gone now. I'll go to the office, Sandhya 21. <laughs> I have to change my password now. Um, I'm going to... <laughs> to the orchestra, we'll change the password, okay? <laughs> Um, to, to the orchestra who accompanied Sandhya today, another round of applause for them, please. <laughs> now, what was not shared is the fact that Karthik is a, a, a parent second time round, and his baby is all of a couple of days old, but he's been there for every single practice for Sandhya. <laughs> and... And, and, and we have yet another emerging artist of the future. So congratulations on behalf of all of us. And thank you for being there for Sandhya. Raga and Narayan, thank you for turning up for all the practices. And I hope you enjoyed the moments at Goodman Art Center. She definitely did, because we always had evening stories after practices. So thank you so much for being here, performing. Swadi, you've made uh, Sandhya run all over Singapore, up the stairs, down the steps, and I think the stamina today, I think we've got to give a lot of credit to Swadi. <laughs> and, and Bhavani, who is not here with us today, but she, she came home this morning for one whole hour, hour and she made a stand on her head. So, you know, that, that, that much of dedication and love. She couldn't be here because of prior commitments, but I, I know she sent Sandhya off with a lot of stretches and a lot of love as well. Um, I'm going to mention a few people. Sneha Chichi, please come out, Sneha Chichi. So, Sneha Chichi is, is Sandhya's dance, dance Chichi, as in Akka, like older sister. And she's been there with her every step of the way. Um, after things started going down south, right? For the last two years, every single step of the way. So she's just not been here the last month because we had a performance, but every step of the way, suddenly I'll say, I love Sneha Chechi. She'll tell me what to do. So Sneha Chechi, thank you for being a Chechi <laughs> and being there for her. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm going to mention uh, Sandhya's uh, Arangetram mates who are all up coming for their Arangiri term soon, so I hope all of you come and watch them as well. Vaishali, Shama, Navina. Okay, they're all shouting at the back there, but all young dancers who just love coming together, expressing themselves. And I want to thank them because they encouraged her, cajoled her, were there for her when the moments really were tough. So girls, all the best for your Arangiri and thank you for being there for her. Uh, Shiva Praveena, who dressed up my dear daughter today. Ne Neishma, thank you so much for doing the script. It was really, really wonderful. Uh, Varshaka, Varshaka who's, who's the designer of the brochures and the in invite, etc. All young talents that I'm just so amazed by and I'm so lucky, we are so lucky to be surrounded by them. Mala Mohan, I saw you in the crowd. I have to thank you because we are standing here because you brought me back to Temple of Finance in 2012. So I will never forget the source. <laughs> Mala, myself, and Lakshmi belong to a WhatsApp group called Old is Gold. <laughs> we'll just stick with the gold. Forget about the old, okay? Thank you so much. And, and that's the reason why we're here today. Uh, there are so many people, like we call, Swamji used to call everyone the backstage crew, the, the dirty dozens, basically. Well, there are more than a dirty dozen people in the back, back, background have, you know, putting this production together. Um, up in the, the lighting is Shreya, Shreya Bhatt. Thank you so much. Lalit, who's been the program manager. Lalit, thank you for being such a pain and keep asking me for so many things. And 
and you've been awesome just in getting things organized, etc. I think it's, it's deeply appreciated. Um, we have close to, I don't know, Balas and my friends in this room, 38, 48 years of, 40 to 40 years of friendship in this, in this room. Um, so to each and every one of you, thank you for your friendship through our lives. Thank you for being part of my daughter's dance journey today, our daughter's dance journey today. And, and you know, I'm really looking forward to many more years of friendship as well. Yeah. So coming back to the orchestra, okay? So I, I did a bit of a skip around in terms of the teachers, etc. I would like to especially call out Raju sir, okay? <laughs> So when a, when a dancer starts her Arangetram practice, there's obviously the dance teacher, and then there's the Mridangist, who is there at every step of the way. And I'm not sure, I mean, you would have heard that with every stamping of her feet, he was giving her the cues and rhythms together with the Natavangam as well. Raju sir, you have been absolutely wonderful in just encouraging her. And now I come to Lakshmi, and please take out the tissue paper, okay? Um, so, so Lakshmi is my teacher as well. So how lucky is one to have a teacher in common with their daughter? And that's who she is. So Lakshmi. Um, mothers come in many forms. You are her true dance mother. And thank you for being there every step of the way. And working with Bala, when things got really tough and she truly wanted to give up. And if it was not that partnership that you had with Bala, not with this dance mom, because it's very difficult being a child of a dance mom, right? But the partnership she had with my Bala that has got Satya here today. Thank you so much. To our family, uh, Arjun? Uh, Arjun, where are you, Arjun? <laughs> Arjun? Arjun, who is yet another dance friend and mate who she really looks up to because he has amazing dance form. So Arjun, thank you for being here this morning just to help with the setup and everything. Thank you so much, Arjun. Um, okay, now I come to family, okay? Um, uh, I, I've thanked all the friends. I come to family, my, my dear sisters who are responsible for the column outside. <laughs> they, they, they're more than responsible for the column outside. One sister has been my, my dance transporter as I was growing up as a dancer, and the other sister has been my fellow dancer as we were growing up as well. So th thank you for being my sisters and just the unconditional love that comes with all of that. To Bala siblings, Anna, uh, Vini Akka, Mutyana, thank you so much for being here. And Bala would really, really appreciate the fact that the family is here with us every step of the way. Honey, thank you very much. All our nieces, all our nephews, not to forget my dear brother-in-law who's masked and looking like a... <laughs> The man with the bell is my brother-in-law, okay? So if you've got any complaints, come look for me later. And if all my nieces, nephews, thank you for making this such a joyous journey for all of us. Okay, so now we come to the three of you, okay? So um, Sharanya and Sangeeta, I think you guys don't understand how important you are to the middle child here. You are there to drive her around half the time and you are there to provide entertainment. <laughs> and, 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 and this is precious, and I truly hope that this continues throughout your life because you three are Appas and Amma's gift. So thank you very much for choosing us as your parents. <laughs> okay, so Bala's not here physically tonight, yeah? But I'm going to share a message that he had for Sharanya at her 21st birthday last year, which I think, you know, 
with the, with the benefit of hindsight, I think he wrote it for his girls in years to come. And it reads something like this, Molo, from Appa. I want you to know deeply, I want you to deeply believe in your good heart that you are capable of achieving whatever you set your mind to. That you will never lose, you will never lose, either you win or you learn. And just go forth and aim for the skies. I cannot be promised, I cannot promise to be here for the rest of your life. But I promise to love you for the rest of my and beyond. Sandhya, today, for Appa and Amma, you have not just won, but you have learned so much. We are very proud of you now and forever. So, well done, Molo. You have learned. God bless you. Our family ends the year with a lot of gratitude, love and joy in our hearts that extends to each and every one of you who has actually taken the time to be with us here physically and also tuning in through the live stream. Before the Thunderbalan girls sign off, you have an announcement. Eh? Before we end tonight, we would like to share that TFA will be moving to downtown gallery it is a time of exciting growth and momentum, so do stay updated on TFA's updates through our official Facebook and Instagram pages. So from the Tanabalan girls to all of you and your families, wishing you an abundance of love and joy and an amazing start to 2023. Thank you, everyone.